Hello, this is our safe, the vault router. In order to crack the safe, you'll need to solve two puzzles, but each one of them will give you four digits code, and when you sum them up, you'll get the code for the safe. In the first puzzle, you have a card, but on top of it, there is a spinning bottle, a LCD screen, that the code is written on it, and in front of it, there is a polarizing filter, so when you look for it, you won't be able to read the code. In order to solve the puzzle, you have to blow on the card vertically in the direction of the movement, and so it will move towards the screen, and when it reaches in front of the screen, you will be able to see the code through the polarizing filter. The card is actually a platinum rotor that is based on the Magnus effect. That way, it's moving the card forward. The battle is a polarizer. That way, it cancels the polarized light from the LCD screen and allows us to see what is written on it. The second riddle includes an engine that is connected to a smartphone. The record of the second code is played on the phone. The burglars get wooden stick, a cup made of cardboard, and a perforator. To hit the code, the burglars have to perforate the stick and insert the engine shaft into the hole they made in the stick. The burglars should make the stick touch the cup and hear the code via the glass by placing the cap on one burglar's ear. Electrical signals from the telephone are sent via the cable in the form of AC voltage that is converted in the DC motor into oscillations. From there, the oscillations are transformed to a mechanical wave that moves through the stick to the cup. The cup serves as a resonance box, thereby the sound is amplified and the audio files can be heard.